My name is Lars Peter Thiesen. I'm working for General Motors Europe and I'm responsible for our hydrogen and fuel cell deployment strategy in Europe. We at GM, we believe that hydrogen and fuel cells are the future. Um, and what you can see here is our newest product. It's the GM Hydrogen 4. This car runs on a fuel cell. The fuel cell is powered by hydrogen coming out of the tank in the back of the vehicle. A uh, fuel cell combines hydrogen and oxygen from air to produce electricity, which again uh, powers the electric motor that drives the wheels of this vehicle. And the only exhaust of the vehicle is pure water vapor, so it's a true zero emission vehicle. What we have changed uh, from the Hydrogen 3 to the Hydrogen 4 is that this car is uh, manufactured in uh, 100 units. Uh, this car is uh, much improved relative to durability, relative to its performance. It's very dynamic in driving. And as you can see here, it is uh, well carried out. So it is not anymore looking like a car coming out of the labs. It looks like a real car um, with all the features that you are used to have in a real car, including uh, comfort and safety, safety like uh, frontal airbags, side airbags, um, like uh, ABS, like traction control, and, uh, and other features uh, relative to comfort, like navigation system and whatnot. The Hydrogen 4 runs on hydrogen, compressed hydrogen at a pressure level of 700 bar, uh, which is equivalent to 10,000 PSI. It, which is stored in three containers in the back of the vehicle and the hydrogen is then given to the fuel cell in the front which produces electricity and the only waste product out of this uh, reaction is pure water vapor that is finally coming out of those exhaust pipes. So again, this car is a pure zero emission vehicle.